pancreatic cancer is one of the fastest growing cancers and has always been one of the most lethal cancers. Hi, I'm Dr. Thomas Clancy. I'm the director of the Pancreas Cancer Program in the Division of Surgical Oncology at Brigham and Women's Hospital in Boston. So, what is pancreatic cancer? Pancreatic cancer starts in the pancreas, an organ that sits in the abdomen behind your stomach. By producing enzymes and hormones, your pancreas helps your body break down food and control your blood sugar. So what are pancreatic cancer symptoms? Usually, when we think of pancreatic cancer, we mean tumors of the exocrine pancreas, or adenocarcinoma. Symptoms can include jaundice, or yellowing of the skin or eyes, loss of appetite, bloating in the belly, upper abdominal discomfort or mid-back pain, changes in bowel function, new onset diabetes, nausea or vomiting, and unexplained weight loss. A second type of pancreas tumor is referred to as a pancreatic neuroendocrine tumor. These types of tumors may have no symptoms at all and sometimes can be associated with overproduction of various hormones. Especially when small, they may act in a very benign manner and may not even need treatment. Is there a test for pancreatic cancer? Can you find pancreatic cancer symptoms early? Unfortunately, pancreatic cancer is hard to find early. The pancreas is deep inside the body, so early tumors can't be seen or felt by healthcare providers during routine physical exams. People may have no symptoms unless the tumor becomes large or causes obstruction of a bile duct. There is no general screening test for pancreatic cancer, but people who have a family history of the disease or a family history of certain other cancers may be candidates for genetic testing. This testing looks for the genetic changes associated with increased pancreatic cancer risk. Your risk may be increased if you have one of these mutations, but it doesn't mean that you have or definitely will get pancreatic cancer. Researchers are studying other new tests to try to find pancreatic cancer early. Interested patients at high risk may wish to take part in studies of these new screening tests. What is pancreatic cancer treatment? The treatment depends on the stage of your pancreatic cancer. The types of treatments include surgery, chemotherapy, and radiation, sometimes as part of a clinical trial. Most people will get a combination of treatments, such as chemotherapy followed by an operation, and sometimes radiation. Many patients will want to know, am I a candidate for surgery? And what I say is that we hope to be able to operate, but it depends on the stage of the tumor. For instance, has the disease spread, or are there nearby organs or blood vessels involved? So it's very important to be evaluated by an expert team. For neuroendocrine tumors, surgery and occasionally chemotherapy are the primary ways to treat them. A pancreatic cancer diagnosis can be devastating, but great progress is being made in treating this disease. The future is so hopeful as we continue to perform leading research and provide the most advanced treatment options for our patients. Thanks for watching. I'm Dr. Thomas Clancy. To learn more about other types of cancer, click here. And don't forget to subscribe.